the people aren't used to really doing these sorts of dramas, so I would have to read things in the whatever voice the the actor actually in the in the original Jesus film read it in order for them to be able to mimic that intonation. So it was a lot of fun. Uh, the people really enjoyed that, and uh, they followed me really well. Lipusabana, Lipusabana, Maruto Harwa Babu, Maruto Harwa Babu. One of the interesting things when we were recording the Jesus film was how to portray Jesus on the cross. The actor that uh, played the part of Jesus um, needed to have stress in his voice, needed to have a weakness to his voice um, and suffering. Our audio engineer, Jin Wan, asked our actor, uh, Dominique, to get down and do some push-ups uh, to tire him out. After that was done, uh, we had his friend Sumwali come over and he jumped on his back and uh, he had to carry him around the room and uh, that put a lot of stress in his voice and made the, the, the scene come alive. When we announced that we were going to do the Jesus film, there were a lot of people who wanted to be a part of it. There's one video clip that we have where I was standing in the background behind everyone and Scott was trying to coach them on what they were to say and Jin Wan had the microphone and it was for the scene where Jesus was with Pilate and they were all yelling crucify him or kill him or Jesus and they were just hollering different things and it was funny to watch because there's people jumping up and down and people yanking on the bush and, and really getting into their parts and stuff even though they weren't being videotaped it was just all audio. Um, but it was just fun to see how they were really enthusiastic about the whole thing. The people, when they read the, the Bible, they have a really hard time trying to figure out what's a parable and what really happened, what was a historical event. And the Jesus video puts together um, that very nicely so that they can understand when Jesus was telling a story to illustrate a point versus when he was actually doing a miracle or asking someone a serious question. One thing we really like about the Jesus film is that it starts off with a background with the Old Testament. And so it shares some of the stories of the Old Testament to help give a framework for Jesus' life. And then also at the end of the film, it gives an invitation for salvation. When we were finished recording the Jesus film, the recordist uh, put it together in a sort of a raw form. It hadn't been mastered yet. And uh, we showed it to the people uh, in two different villages at night. Their usual reaction to movies, um, especially if there's violence, is they sort of laugh at it. But as Jesus was being nailed to the cross and going through his suffering um, of the Passion Week, um, they just sort of sat in stunned silence. Everything was very quiet. Um, there were even a few people who cried. Um, and uh, it really touched them in a deep way. <laughs>